How's it going, YouTube? Mitch Santona here with part two of my comic series Toys R Us exclusive Marvel Universe characters. This is Iron Man. Okay, like in part one, Captain America comes in this nice little collectible box, and they do look great in the box. Here's his bio if you'd like to read it. Pause it there. Shows a little construction ring, which we will be doing and lighting it all up, making it all pretty like. Seems like Iron Man comes with a little pulsar blast here. Repulsor blast, I should say. And you have the Try Me button, which lights up the base. Let's take him out and play. Okay, just like the Captain America, it comes with the base. We will switch it into the on position as opposed to Try Me. And then that will remain on for a good period of time. So let's make sure to turn that off and not wear out these batteries. A little bit of fair warning here. This packaging is like packaging from the seventh level of Hades. It's real difficult to get the guy out of here without popping stuff off, so be very careful. All right, so here is a comic series Iron Man. This, I, I'm not sure what Mark suit this is, and maybe somebody can chime in and let me know what it's supposed to represent, but it is from the comics, and it does look quite nice in hand. I think the one thing that impresses me the most is these little white dots. They look like they're actually lit up because they're so bright against his color scheme, and then they have these little blue rings around them, and they actually have these, like, little black... You can see, it's so tiny. Just these little black, I guess, details all around them. Very, very cool. I'll just give you a quick little spin around here and just show you all of the little details of this guy. Really, really does make for an impressive look with all these little bits that they added in. Very, very cool. And there he is next to the Avengers movie Iron Man, one of the Iron Mans from the movie. And this guy's got way more posability than that does all day long. Let's check out some of that articulation and posability. A little bit of head nod there, but he really can't. More, more just turning. Uh, but you see the little shoulder swivels here. Upper arms, elbows, hands, ab crunch or chest, whatever you want to call it. So he doesn't have a waist per se, but he does have an upper arm or an upper uh, chest swivel here, upper abdomen, if you will, and just his chest will spin around, so that's that makes for some good realistic movement there. That there, got a double hinge on the knees, that's always very, very cool. He's got a hinged foot as well, no ankle tilts per se, but uh, for the most part, this guy is super duper posable. It can also do that, so yeah, nice. And here we have his little clip-on gimmick that just clips onto the bottom of his arm there, and he's got a little blue, rubbery, clear, tornado, repulsor, blast, in-your-face-of-doom thing. Avengers Assemble. Oh yeah, baby, that's how we assemble Avengers. There's Bucky, Cap, and Iron Man interconnected these connect very very tightly very nice light them both up can't wait to complete the ring i got thor coming up next guys stay tuned for that plus another couple of build-a-figures that i'm sure you'll enjoy i'll see ya